Detectives in Nairobi have arrested eight suspects in connection with a fake money syndicate. Two Dutch nationals were lured into the country by the scammers who drew them into their trap saying that they had robbed the central bank of Togo in West Africa of a colossal sum of money that had apparently been transported to Nairobi. The scammer saying that they were in a position to transfer the sum to the Dutch nationals. In the process, they were to lose $63,000, amounting to about 21.6 million shillings. Our very own Hazem Mugambi has more. Wednesday evening at Viraj Complex along Mombasa Road, Nairobi, detectives nabbed 40 pellets and six metal boxes full of fake U.S. dollars. According to an investigation report seen by Citizen TV, the consignment was staged to deceive two Dutch nationals that they were about to be on the receiving end of some 439 trillion Kenya shillings stolen from the Central Bank of Togo and shipped to Nairobi. <laughs> The scammers in this warehouse assumed the roles of custom and police officers. Their gear has since been impounded. It is here that they informed their victims they were supposed to pay duty for the consignment to the tunes of 36,000 US dollars. The duo flew to Kenya to facilitate the clearance of the 40 pellets containing 4 billion US dollars as per the narrative sold to them by the scammers. The pilots said to have contained money, each had two bags of cement sealed inside. Eight suspects believed to be workers of a scammer's cartel operating along Mombasa Road through to Siokimau in Kitengela were arrested. The suspects include Moses Otieno, Peter Aura, Peter Kasinya, Brian Waweru, Noah Oma, John Kalambo, Charity Njeri and Masi Chepto. They are expected to be arraigned Thursday. Presumably for purposes of seeking authenticity, the scammers have moved from residential areas and apartments to business complexes such as this one. A clear indication that the trade is getting bigger by the day. Hassan Mugambi, Citizen TV.